let's look at this. How do you solve this? What I am aiming at here is to have something like this. A raised to power 2, B raised to power 2. Because I know if I can have something like this, I can easily reduce it to this and this. This is very common. You should know this. So that's what I want to aim at. Okay? That is to have anything here that is traced to power 2. Anything here that is traced to power 2. So you agree with me? This is 3 raised to power 2. This one, I can remove this to say 2, 10 raised to power 2. Because this multiplied by this, we see, give us 20. So I can call this one A, I can call this one B. So with this now, I have something like this. Okay? So I can now come here to say 2 raised to power 10 plus 3. 2 raised to power 10 minus 3. Okay? So with this now, I am good to go. How do I work on this? Only this. I said 2 raised to power 10. You agree with me? It's also equals to 2 raised to power 5. 2. So this is 32 raised to power 2. So I will call this one. What is 32 raised to power 2? That is 10, 24. You agree with me? This will give us 10, 27, multiplied by 10, 21. So what this one requires us to do now is to do... Then we multiply, then we start doing multiplication because we are asked not to use calculator. This is 7, 2, 0, 1. This is 4, 5, 0. This will give us 2. Then we use 0, that is 0, 0, 0, 0. We use 1, 7, 2, 0, 1. Okay? If you look at this now, this is 7, 6, 5, 8, 4, 0, 1. Which is? So this is our answer. Okay? Hope this understood. Thank you for viewing. Please subscribe and share this video. Thank you.